It is dawn. The sun is conquering the sky, and my grandmother and I are speaking prayers to the horizon. This morning, she is teaching me the meaning of Hanjan. Although there is no direct translation from the Navajo language into English, every living being knows what Hanjan means. For Hanjan is every eyelash. It is every leaf on every tree. It is every raindrop. It is every feather on the bluebird's wing. Hanjan is undeniable beauty. And my grandmother knows this well, for she speaks a language that grew up out of the desert floors like red sandstone monoliths reaching into the sky like the arms of the earth, praising creation for all of its brilliance. Hanjan is remembering that we are a part of this brilliance. creator. Hanjan is an experience, but it is not something you can experience alone, the eagles tell us as they lock talons in the stratosphere and fall to the earth as one. Hanjan is inter-beauty. And my grandmother knows this well, for she speaks the language of the male rain, which shoots lightning boys through the sky, pummels the green corn children, and huddles the horses against the cliff sides in the early afternoon. She also speaks the language of the female rain, which sends the scent of dust and sage into our homes, into our hogans, and cast rainbows in the sky. Us Dene, we know what Honjan means. And each and every one of you, no matter the color of your skin or where you are from, knows what Honjan means. And deep down inside, I think we know what Honjan does not mean. Like the days we walk in sadness, like the days we live for money, like the days that we live for fame, or even the day that the conquistadors came, climbed down from their horses and asked us if they could buy the mountains. Now, we knew this was not Honjon because we knew you cannot buy a mountain, but we knew we could make it Honjon once again. So we took their silver swords, and we took their silver coins, and we melted them with fire and buffalo hide bellows, and recast them into beautiful silver and turquoise squash blossom jewelry pieces and strung it around their necks. We took the helmets straight off of their heads and transformed it into a fearless beauty. We made jewelry. Hanjan is the healing of broken bones. Hanjan is the prayer that carried us through genocide and disease. Hanjan is the prayer that will carry us through this global warming, through this global fear that has cast shadows in our minds. This morning, my grandmother is teaching me something very important. She is teaching me that the easiest and most elegant way to defeat an army of hatred is to sing it beautiful songs until it falls to its knees and surrenders. It will do this, she says, because it has finally found a sweeter fire than
than revenge. It has found heaven. It has found Honjon. And so my grandmother is talking to the colors of the sky at dawn, facing east. And she is saying, Honjon Hasli, Honjon Hasli, Honjon Hasli, Honjon Hasli, which means beauty is restored again. It is dawn, my friends. Wake up. The night is over. Shot from the bow, I am just an arrow. Shot from the bow. 